Hey guys, this is Chris, the Lower Slower Board Gamer, and I thought I would bring you a multi-part playthrough of Robinson Crusoe and the Cursed Island. We're going to be doing a solo playthrough with uh, three characters doing the Jenny Needs Help scenario, scenario number three. And this will be part one. We'll probably go over the first two turns and do separate videos along that same line, two turns at a time, you know. Keep it manageable and have a little series. So without any further ado, let's get on down to the table, shall we? So as you can see, we have everything set up. We've got our um, cards up here. We have our mystery cards, our events. Uh, we're starting with food crates. We have our building, our um, gathering, our exploration. Yes. And we have our nine initial uh, inventions. Shovel is covered because of the beach terrain right there. And we've also got furnace, cellar, drums. I took one extra. Well, guess what? We're going to we're gonna take this one out. It was the last one. I'm only supposed to take five. So it's furnace, cellar, drums, belts, sack is what we have. Um, our weather dice, our... Uh, Starter items is empty bottle plus one two weapon and Bible. When a player does uh, arrange camp, they get three determination tokens and a health back instead of just two determination tokens. And let's show you our uh, characters, shall we? Think. We have the carpenter. Um, we have the explorer. And we have the soldier. And we also have our scenario, which is Jenny needs help. Uh, your castaways on a deserted island. Your situation is very difficult, but look over there. There's one of your shipmates. Beautiful Jenny trapped on a lonely rock in the middle of the ocean. You need to build a raft and rescue her, and then you better hurry and build a boat to escape the island. The hurricane is approaching fast. Um, goal of the scenario, two goals. First, build the raft and rescue Jenny. Second, build the lifeboat to get off the island. Uh, other special rules. Until the moment of rescue, Jenny gets two wounds every night phase. When she is rescued, take an additional pawn that represents Jenny. Ah, uh, dee da dee da uh, She is now treated as one of the players. She's affected by all events that affect all players. And by the unfulfilled demands rule. Uh, she is affected by weather. During the night phase, she must eat and can get wounds for sleeping in the open air. Jenny does not change the cost of built in, building the shelter, roof, or palisade. And she cannot become the first player. During the action phase, Jenny can only take the rest action and heal one wound. She does not benefit from the bed or the hammock, which I don't have anyway. And then we have our four totem discoveries. And we have herbs. Ruined Hut for two wood. Pistol temporarily gives plus three. And also vines, which adds to the palisades. But uh, your book event is a storm. A hurricane is approaching and it hits the camp. The palisades get reduced by one. So this is going to be quite the battle to keep the palisades up. Um, we need to rescue her on the fifth turn, which means the fifth turn we have to build the raft. And we need rope. So by the fourth turn, we need the rope, which means we need to have the uh, slight hill or grasslands territory. So by the third turn, we need to find the grasslands territory. So we need to get on the exploring, and we have the explorer. Let's go ahead and just start the first turn. We're going to skip the event. We have food crates right here. Um... Yeah, let's move that over there. So we are on day one. Uh, second is morale. No morale. So we go straight to um, placing our heroes and heroines. So the explorer, I think, is definitely going to explore. Not a doubt in my mind. Um, oh, nope. I'm sorry. Uh, resource. Yeah, getting ready to skip something already. So we do get a wood. And we do get a food. Uh, where's it at? Right there. 
I don't have upgraded tokens. I'm a poor man. From a poor family. Um, if we get the food, we make it through the first turn. No problem. So I think... Uh, Carpenter needs to... Ah, uh, how are we going to do this? we got to keep the morale up. That's what we need to do. We need to keep the morale up. So I believe... Carp... Uh, no. Explorer really needs to go here. Instead. Explorer needs to go there. Uh, Carpenter is going to... Um, build the shovel. We will, we don't have a lot. The cellar needs the shovel. Um, the knife we need to get off the island, but we don't have the mountain yet. Okay, we don't have wood. So we can't do the shelter yet. We just have the campsite, which is fine. So I think the soldier is going to, we have a wood, so we're going to build a weapon. And I think the soldier is going to explore, as is the carpenter. Um, now, oh, we need to get that food. We need to get that food. Let's do that. We're both going to go down here and we're going to get that food. Let's get that food for the first turn. Be good. Alrighty. So now we go to the action phase. So we do get our food. Ah, uh, soldier carpenter. This goes away. And we do get one regular food. One non-perishable food. Uh, next is going to be building. And we're building the shovel. Carpenter has two determination tokens. Uh, it is a success. No wound, but we do have an adventure. So we have built the shovel. Take that black marker off, and we have an adventure coming right up. Um, adventure for building. Let's go ahead and see what we have here real quick. In a hurry. Uh, I wanted to block that, so I'm going to block it so I can't see it. Uh, in a hurry. Decide. Discard this card or draw two uh, discovery tokens and shuffle it into the deck. Discovery tokens. I think I'm going to do that. I think I am going to do that. Uh, so we'll put this here. Now shuffle up, starting on the next turn. So I can't see what the bottom card is and anticipate it. I will draw off the bottom of the pile. Boom. Uh, two discovery tokens, which I have right over here, off camera, I think. And they're there. They've been shuffled. So we're just going to draw two of those. Uh, first, we're going to have herbs. Which means if I have the pot, then that increases morale. And then we have... Uh, ruined Hut gives us two wood. Okay. Alright. Boom, boom. Uh, any more building? No. Belt provides one of these workers. That's why I have one of the gray workers there to help with the exploring, should that come up. Or gathering, rather. Sorry. And we're not gathering. We have three workers left. Oh, over here. That's right. So we are going to explore. We'll explore the explorer first. We have a wound. We have an adventure. We have a success. So she's going to take a wound. 
Um, we have already uncovered the mountain. We still have to do an adventure. So I'll leave that adventure die right there to remind me. Um, we get a beast to hunt. And we get another discovery token. Oh, and that token would be... Ah, uh, two uh, perishable food. That's not a bad thing to have right there. We get in a tight spot, that'll be it. And an adventure. Um, ah, jeez. Puma attacks. You spot a puma in the bushes. If you go back to the camp now, you will bring death with you. Discard this card or execute the night phase outside of camp. And execute the night phase outside of camp. Or shuffle into the event deck. Mm. This one I think we're going to discard. No. No, we're not. We're going to shuffle it into the event deck. I know what is going to happen as a result of that at some point, but now I, I can't do that. So I shuffle these up again. We just want regular events is what we want. And I mix them up a little more without seeing the backs of them at all. All right, there we go. And I'll draw off the bottom. Okay. That be done. Now we're going to go here with the soldier. Same thing. We have a success, a wound, and an adventure. So we have a wound for the soldier. We have a success. So another tile comes up. And that is the hills. And we get more stuff. Ah, we get... Another discovery token. And that is a goat, a pelt, and another food. And we also get the first one of these over here. Dink, number one. And that is going to be Slippery Rocks. The player who explored this tile with this icon gets two wounds. That's going to be the soldier. One, two. That goes there. These come back, by the way. We still have an adventure. Let's leave him there so we know who's taking the adventure. Adida. Another exploring adventure. Um, remains of a settlement. Uh, deep in the forest, you discover a ruined settlement. Decide. Discard this card. Or draw three mystery cards and only resolve one trap and two treasures. And shuffle into the deck. It's one trap and two treasures. I think we got to take advantage of that. Let's do it. Let's live dangerously. We'll shuffle that right in there real quick. Dink, 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 dink. Okay. Okay, so we're going to take three of these. Treasure, treasure. Well, these first two are treasures. This one is going to discard. Because we need to get a trap. Trap. Okay, so we have blankets. Oh, blankets is good. Um, ignore one snow during the weather phase discard when they've all been used okay i'm kind of digging that blankets is good one we'll just leave it there ah we'll probably put it over there by the weather phase so that way we know to do it so let's do that let's put it over here where we think of it yeah 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 and then the second treasure is a whip. Uh, keep this card, start the next round. Whenever a player draws a mystery card where a trap must be resolved, the effect of one trap can be ignored. 
<laughs> okay, so Indiana Jones has his bull whip. Does give us plus one to our weapon value. Uh, we're going to leave that right next to it. And then we have a trap, spider web. Spider crawls onto your sleeve and bites you. Get one wound. If you don't have medicine, get one wound during each night phase each round. So we need to do the medicine, and we don't have the place to do the medicine yet. Crap. All right, soldier goes there. And we're going to put that by his card so we am members. Okay, that is the end of that. Next, we are going on to... I probably should have. Sorry about that. So the blankets are over here. Uh, spider web I put by the soldier. Uh, we've left the whip here as a reminder. Um, that's the action phase. Uh, almost. We have one more. Uh, arranging the camp, which is the explorer. So the explorer, because of the Bible, is going to take three determination tokens instead of two and heal that wound. So one, two, she's got five determination tokens. And that wound has been healed. Alrighty, um, next is going, and the morale goes up, go up morale. Next is going to be the weather phase, there is no weather, for each missing, God, but about. okay, then night phase, players can move the camp, we're not going to move the camp, it's a trap, each player must discard one food or they get two wounds. Well, we have one, two. Let's do the goat. Which gives us a third. Yeah, I'll move that out of the way. The goat is going to give us a third perishable food, which we're going to use. And also a pelt. So now we have a pelt. Um, let's also do the Ruined Hut, which is going to give us two wood as per the scenario. So we have two wood. That's a good start kind of right there, I think. Okay, we need to explore so we can find, well, well A, find that so we can build the rope, but also so we can build the medicine. Um, night phase. Um, each player must discard. If you do not have a shelter, each player gets a wound. So, uh, Explorer, Carpenter finally gets a wound. And the Soldier gets a wound, which is going to cross a morale point. So, it's back down to zero. we got to get the morale up. Got to get the morale up. Very important. Okay. Doink, doink, doink. So, we go to... The second turn, the second day. Alrighty, just a rehash of what we have over here. Even though you're looking at it for a long time, um, we are on the second turn. Uh, we have to rescue. Oh, I almost forgot with Jenny. She takes two wounds every night phase. Okay, um, we've done the ruined hut. We need to build the raft and rescue her by the fifth turn. Lifeboat by the eighth turn to get off the island. Our soldier has two determination points, but has five wounds and has dropped the morale. Our explorer has one wound, but five determination tokens. And our carpenter, one wound, two determination tokens. So here we go to the second around second turn first draw an event off the bottom just a regular event good that's the way we want it um let's put it right there so we can see it chronic tiredness you can no longer work with an empty belly um so it is green question mark for Exploration. We'll put that there. Um, during the, that's not what we do. No, doesn't say to do that. Put it back, Durf. 
Uh, during the night phase of this round, each player must meet an additional food or they get one wound. Put the plus one food in the night space as a reminder. Okay. Um, plus one goes right there. Got it. Uh, we can discard this card and get two determination if we put two workers there. We've got the food. We may save that determination for when we truly need it. Which is going to be doing some of this awesomeness stuff we're going to be doing. I almost forgot. Um, we have the mountains so we can build the knife. And uh, the fire. Good. And we have the shovel so we can build the cellar. And we have the rolling hillies, so we can make the pot. Oh, the pot. Uh, I might do that for the morale. We can make bricks. And do all the drums as morale. Oh, sweet. Uh, we're going to build that right now. We're going to build the drums. Yes, we're going to build the drums. Get that morale right the heck up. Yes. Okay. Um... Then we go to morale. Um, first player, the new lead player is the explorer. Um, we have zero on the track, but that's fine. Uh, next we go to resources. Um, we get a wood. We get a wood. A wood. And we get a food. Okay, boom. Next, uh, we need to send our people out. We need to find that and make medicine as quickly as we can. So Explorer is going to go here. Uh, let's make sure that we're going to get that right. Uh, give me a sec, let me think about that. And uh, yes, this does go there because it was on the event card. So there's going to be an adventure no matter what. She's going to do that. I do believe the soldier is going to hunt. Uh, we need to build the drums. We have one pelt. So that's going to go there. Do we want to guarantee that? Because that's morale. That's morale. We have one, two, three, four food. Um, two more people. <sighs> No, oh man, we need the drums. And she's going to arrange camp. So the explorer is going to do something. I think we need to... Um, what can she do? They can do one fewer wood. She's got... Reroll any green action, die, discard... Two, to draw three island tiles from the stack, look at them, and choose one. Shuffle the other two back in. Um, discard three to increase three morale, and morale by one level. Or discard three and draw two discovery. Keep one and discard the other. Now, not going to do any of that yet. Um, we may... Ah, we need more food. He's hunting. We've got a one. We've got the empty bottle. If need be, we can use it once. Hopefully it's not a big critter. I think we need to guarantee that. And we're going to pick and choose and see how good a one we can get. Okay, so we go to action phase four. Uh, first, we are not doing anything with the threat action. Not yet. Uh, second is hunting, so we are hunting. And the beast is Wild Dog, weapon of three. We are, oh, the soldier is getting his 
butt kicked. He's going to use the empty bottle to make that a weapon level of two. There's nothing else he can do. So he's going to take a wound. Um, and the weapon does not degrade. We get two food. Good. We need that. And another uh, pelt. Another skin. Another fur. So he has done his. He's got another wound. He's going to have to heal at some point. It really is. Um, next is... Um, build and we are building the drums uh, let's see what we get we need a success badly we need a success um, we can discard two of her determination tokens right there to reroll any die if needed hopefully not that's a success good we got it okay that's what we wanted it's a success. So let me just flip it over and then we will continue. I haven't even looked at the other dice. Dink. And that is plus two during the morale phase. So I'm going to place that right up here as a reminder. Yay, drums. So that was a success. And she takes a wound. Okay, no adventure. I'm kind of cool with that. Ox uh, Carpenter takes a wound. Get off it, area, you little piece of something. All right. Okay, that is building. We have, let's put her back. Then we have three left. Uh, we have arrange the camp and explore. Explore is next. We're not gathering, so explore. Uh, that is a guarantee. And I think she's going to spend her two to look at three and pick one. So, yeah, she's going to do that little, neat little determination super skill of hers. Uh, let's see. Look at three. Uh, that's three discoveries. And that gives us the ability to do medicine. That's two discoveries and a beast wood. Mountains. So do we want, I th we want the third discovery. We have two places to get wood from. So, yeah, that's going to be that one. We get three discovery tokens. Hex to the yeah. That's mixed. I really don't plan on doing a lot more exploring in this game. Because I don't plan on moving the camp. But, we'll see. Okay, we go there. Ah, but we're not going to get this stuff done if we don't. But we're going way out in order to do that. Of course, that... We could move here, because that's wood and food. Maybe, we'll see, that, that's possible, because we're not worsening ourselves any. We haven't built anything for the camp yet. All right, so we get three discovery tokens. Let's see what we get. Let's see what we can see. Uh, large leaves, so you get to ignore a rain. Ooh, a treasure, which we're gonna do that. And another goat. Uh, we're going to need to do the goat anyway. One, two, three. I'd rather keep that. Four, five, six. Uh, we'll do those in just a bit when we need to. So let's go ahead and do the treasure token. Unleashed beast. If possible, discard one beast from the hunting deck. There are none here, so we disregard that. Um, all right. Boom. That was the explore. I think uh, we only have arranged the camp. So the carpenter is going to get two determination tokens. She's not going to use the Bible. I don't think. We might save that for the soldier. And move the morale up. So the morale is going to be boom. It's going to be up there. That's awesome. Okay. Neat. Uh, next is going to be weather. There is no weather. Um, next is going to be blankets. Yeah, right. Um, night phase. So we need to... Players can move the camp. I think we're going to do that. 
I think we're going to do just that so we can explore more. Um, ow, we get an adventure. Sorry, we get an adventure. Let's do the adventure real quick. Let's see what the adventure is. Uh, I saw the title, but whatever. Yeah, hold on. We got to see what the adventure is. Uh, cold wind. During your walk, you feel cold winter wind blowing on your back. Shuffle into the event deck. Eek. All right. As I saw what the bottom one was, but eh. I'll shuffle it in. Getting a few adventure event cards here. Okay. Doink. Uh, night. Back to night. Each player must discard one food. We must each player discard two foods. So we have one, two, three. That's the normal. I think we're going to uh, kill the goat for a fourth one and a, another pelt. And then we're going to do nourishing larva for two more. So that's a total of six. So we have satisfied the food thingy. Okay, and then um, each player gets a wound. If we don't have a shelter, we do not have the shelter built as yet. So each player gets a wound. Soldier is accumulating some wounds. All right, and then we go to the next turn. Well, I'll tell you what, that is going to be it for this one. That is going to be part one. Uh, turns one and two of Robinson Crusoe and the Cursed Island. Jenny needs help. Will our survivors be able to get to that rock and rescue Jenny? Can they build the raft in time? And can they build the lifeboat so that way they can get off the island before they are ravaged by storms? Uh, guys, thank you very much for watching. This has been Chris, the Lower Slower Board Gamer. And um, watch um, back here for part two. Should be up in the next day or two. So I'm going to leave this up and we will continue right on through. Thanks for watching, guys, and keep on rolling.